<laughs> All right, welcome back. Well, interesting uh, things happening behind the scenes. Yeah. Um, when we were all uh, try, I'm trying to. I know, because I, I mean, I mean, this this issue sometimes they're needed because um, when it starts doing well, we'll remember this phase mm -hmm. and then we'll say. Um, they, they, they passed through a difficult time yeah. and now they've taken the spot to a place where, where it should be. But then we, we, we shouldn't be having all of this. Mm -hmm. Let's mm -hmm. get to the main action now. No issues. The Nigeria Women's Premier League. Uh, what a story we're having in that one. Week, week 10 gave us some talking points. And when you see the results, you understand what I'm talking about. Let's take a look at Group A results. Uh, Rivers Angels and Ibom Angels, it ended the way it ended in the first mm -hmm. leg. It was 1-1 mm -hmm. and when they traveled to, when Rivers Angels traveled to a quiet bomb and then go less when Ibom Angels travel to River State. What a story we are having in that in that one in the Women's League. Next result, Heartland Queens lost to Abia Angels. Abia Angels came to FC Robo in Lagos, took a point, traveled away again to win 2-0. I'm loving that. I'm changing it. I'm really doing big things with that club. Mm -hmm. In Group B, Natural Amazons defeated Confluence Queens by a single goal. Delta Queens 3, Edo Queens 1, Adamawa Queens 3, Sada to Amazon 0, Pelican Stars and Oshun Babes uh, played goalless. Yeah. And then uh, today, just look at, that game should have been concluded. We'll find out what the result uh, is and then give it to you because rainfall stopped the match between Bielsa Queens and, and FC Robo yesterday. The game was supposed to be played um, 9 this morning. Uh, should still be on. We'll, we'll get the results mm -hmm. and bring uh, it to you. Immediately that happens, um, we'll, we'll let you know where do we... Uh, go from Let's talk about Manny Pacquiao. Yeah, that, that, that's where we should be going mm. right now. Aman Pacquiao has back calls uh, from <laughs> people in the Philippines that look, the WBO should review this bout. Mm. It's controversial loss to Australia's Jeff Hunt. Uh, initially, he said, Well, I accept uh, the results, but then again, after a lot of calls, he said, well, WBO, I think it's time you guys should review this bout. Mm. And uh, he also said, uh, you know, the Pac-Man said, look, I think I need to sit down. Yeah. I'm going to think long and hard wow. about retiring. I know. I mean, his words, he says, I love boxing and I don't want to see it dying because of unfair decision and officiating. So when footballers go, oh, the referee did this, it's human error. But this one, a lot of... It's glaring. Everybody is just wondering, how did Jeff Horn get to win this this bout against uh, Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao is one of the few boxers that is truly, truly a gladiator, tries to fight whoever shows up, doesn't pick and choose. Um, I've lost my respect for Mayweather in the last few years uh, before. He was the kind of guy that would say, come, I'll fight you. But now that's why boxers go to places that's like a fortress. You know, the, the Klitschko's will take you to Germany. Some mm. don't fight outside their comfort yeah. zone. And this guy, and th for, in my own books, mm. this is the third time it's mm. happening to money. To money yeah. And he, like, like someone said, don't do this in UFC. All he, three he judges scored um, the Australian. Uh, they gave him the fight. I don't, all strange. three judges. And while Manny Parker is waiting for the WBO to do something, uh, Jeff is already a big boy in Australia. He is. He's getting all the honors. Uh, his eyes, his, his, the left eye that was closed on, on Sunday morning is now opening up. And he's beginning to see clearly. And he's, he's taking all the, all the accolades. In his immediate reaction after that bout, you were looking at Jeff Horn and someone was asking, are you sure this guy that won? Because he had one eye closed. closed. And someone said, are you sure this guy won? The bout. Even the cut on Manny's head was a result of an head, head boot. So, I don't know. I don't know. We, uh, we but, WBO but, should do something. But yesterday, the WBO responded uh, to the controversy on Twitter, and they said uh, that a, a decision uh, could only be reversed in a case of fraud or violation of laws. So it doesn't, it doesn't look like they're going to speak in favor of Manny Pacquiao for this one. So, sadly, that's, that's what it is with, with boxing. Uh, Offic officiating uh, All right. will continue to, to give us majority yeah. to talk. Uh, also, we need to go, but maybe mm. we should just try and see if we can do the paper. Just see the headlines and um, just read through them quickly. Uh, if we can, we have three papers for review um, this morning. Uh, I guess I guess we'll be able to do that. That's, uh, right. that's how we have to wrap up uh, the show uh, this morning. Thanks for watching. We always enjoy knowing that you're right there uh, enjoying what we're doing uh, on the show. We'll do this again tomorrow. I'm Yemi Adbaya. A special thanks to all of you that sent us messages on our social media platforms. We'll make our time to read them tonight. That means you must join us tonight, 9 p.m. for sports uh, tonight. That's the show on behalf of the team. I'm Austin O'Connor, and in everything you do, remember to keep talking sports. Bye for now.